for sale in our vehicle max. We have a 2008 Buick Enclave CXL Pearl White all wheel drive 3.5 V6. Car is equipped with factory navigation, factory DVD. You got the chrome wheels. The tires are not new, but these are good gear Eagles. They got plenty of tread left on them. The car has a clean title and a clean Carfax. You can view right now at our website at vehiclemax.net. If you're watching this video on Auto Trader, let me tell you, it will cut off for three minutes. If you want to see the full 10 minute video, please visit our website, vehiclemax.net. Back here in the back, we got the, uh, the backup sensors, there's four of them. Dual exhaust, the car is running right now. Uh, heavy duty tone package. I believe it's got also a power tailgate, but we'll get into the options in just a few minutes. Roof rack, OnStar, and a number of other options we'll get to once I get to the inside. Okay, stop at the front tire here. Four wheel disc brakes, of course. The car is still under the manufacturer's warranty for the powertrain only of five years or 100,000 miles. Has remote start, and I'll show you that at the very end. Okay, let's go ahead and get inside of it right now. I believe there's a movie playing. Okay. Unlock them both. Okay, let's open this up up here. Alright, we got a kids movie playing up here. This is a DVD player from factory for the middle and rear row passengers. In the front, Okay, you can watch a DVD as well up here. Let me go ahead and turn on the AC. Okay, and uh, now once you put the car on drive, you uh, you won't be able to watch a DVD. That's just a safety uh, safety feature so that people don't get distracted watching TV when they should be watching the road. Okay, let me go ahead and close this rear door here. I'm going to show you the backup camera now. We got the uh, Bose sound system. The door panel is beautiful. It's uh, tan over here with mocha here with a wood trimming around here of the um, power window switches, power door locks and all that. More wood here with a like steel trimming look like here. Uh, we got power folding mirrors, power seats, power recliner, lumbar support. I'll pan over the driver's seat real quickly here now. The seat's in excellent shape, has no tears, no cuts, no discoloration, no burns. As a matter of fact, it uh, looks like whoever was the previous owner of this vehicle was a non-smoker because there's no evidence of odor of smoke or of, um, of burns anywhere on the door panels, carpeting, seats, or even headliner. Okay, let's go ahead and show you what happens when we put the car on reverse. Keep an eye on that screen. Boom, turns into a rear camera. We're back up here so you can get an idea how this works. Not only do we have the rear camera, but we also have the uh, backup sensors. Let me lower this so you can hear me talk. We also got remote stereo controls for the uh, for the radio. Sorry, I'm backing up to make sure. I want to use the camera, but you also definitely want to look back. It's very accurate. Okay, right now you see the flashing, that's our parking sensors letting us know we're getting too close. Okay. And, I mean, you can come literally within inches of the rear vehicles. Okay, that's close enough probably. Alright, um, now you put it back in gear. And until you get to about 10 miles an hour, it stays on the rear camera. Okay. For a few seconds anyway. Okay, we're back up to the, uh, main, uh, this will turn into full screen now, but for now let me show you, well, right there we're on full screen. Let me go ahead and press audio. Let me look into it. We got also XM stereo, which right now it's on preview because you got to sign up for the uh, service, okay? Of course, AM, FM, is yes, we can go back to DVD, auxiliary, and that auxiliary is so you can plug in your iPod right there and listen to it on the stereo for the car. Dual climate control, as you can see right now, the driver's side is at 60 degrees and the passenger side is at 70. We can have them at different temperature settings, okay, for different comfort levels. Alright, um, we got uh, heated seats, okay, with three different levels of heating on both sides, of course. 
Oops, you probably can see because of the shift. All right, and it all works. Okay. Uh, we've got an automatic transmission, right? Yes, but it's got another feature here where we can make a shift. I don't know if you can see the plus and minus buttons here by tapping on that switch, okay? That's the sport portion of it, all right? Make it tap up here, and I'll show you what that looks like up here. All right. See there, we're wearing L. Well, L is so you can shift manually. I'm tapping up, and you can see the numbers going up. I believe this has got a six speed automatic transmission which is actually makes it good on fuel looks like uh, you see that left uh, left rear tire pressure looks like we're just a little low on air we don't mess around with that until it's time for the vehicle to leave because from just sitting here a lot of times it lose a little bit of air and uh, and then just all you got to do is reset it and drive it there are no other lights on there's no check engine lights on no airbag lights on I guess the oil is due for service I'm sure we've done the oil change we just got to reset the light instrument package the car is running right now so I'm gonna rev it so you can see it is running and like I said no check engine lights no airbag lights no anti-lock brake lights no uh, service engine soon lights just um, uh, oil change which just probably needs to be reset because I know we changed the oil and we just probably haven't reset the light we'll do that before the vehicle is delivered uh, towing haul mode there traction control uh, rear wiper this is our on and off switch for the power tailgate and I'll operate that in just a few seconds uh, oh, let me show you the navigation. I almost forgot the most important part of it. Okay, there's your navigation screen. We are inside the building, so our light sensor down there, uh, when, it, when you're inside the building and doesn't see the sun, it makes the screen dark. This is so it's not so bright at night in your face. If we were to drive outside, the screen would turn white. Okay, and at night, this is what it looks like. Okay. Now, uh, that's enough for that. Let's go ahead and show you that you can uh, control the stereo right from here, too. Okay, oh it's on the movie, that's why it's not, you know, you're not hearing it sound very well, just because it's a movie, it's not a, it's not radio. And again, you can control the source here, you can mute it here, you can um, seek and change your uh, stations and so forth. On this side, we got the cruise control. Let me back off a little bit so you can see the steering wheel. The steering wheel is leather wrapped on the sides here, okay, and this area here is wood trimming to match the, uh, the wood on the sides over here. And it's in perfect shape. It's not chipped off or damaged anywhere, or the leather is peeling off, or the stitching is coming apart, or it's missing any color. Um, up here, we got a little storage up here for maps or glasses, whatever you want to put on there. I'll pan over the um, this area up here so you can see it's in perfect shape. It's not cracked or damaged anywhere. We got curtain side airbags right here on the front posts, and we have some back in the rear post, and I'll show you that when we get back there. Got a compass uh, reader uh, there that tells you what direction we're pointing at the OnStar system. For those of you that don't know what the OnStar system, as I'll pan around the vehicle, I'll, I'll tell you more or less what it does. Okay, home link to, uh, to pair up your uh, garage door opener or your gate or your complex where you live. Vanity mirrors on both sides. Okay, the OnStar system um, has a, a couple of pretty neat things it does. For example, number one, if you get into a car accident in any of the airbags, front or side, deploy, it sends a signal to the OnStar Center, let them know you've been in a car accident, they contact you through the car and uh, to make sure you're okay. If you do not respond within a reasonable amount of time, they'll go ahead and dispatch the, um, the emergency vehicles to come to your aid, okay? Also, if you are... Uh, if you're lost and you need directions to the nearest gas station, hotel, restaurant, whatever, they can also help you out with that. All right, I showed you the uh, front and rear post, and also we got side airbags on the seats, quad seating here in the middle, okay, and a full bench seat in the back. So we got uh, two in the front, two in the middle, and three in the back, and they all have an over-the-shoulder belt, including the um, middle row passenger. There's another set of airbags way back there, and I'll show you when I get to the back, okay? Uh, let me finish up in telling you about the OnStar system. Um, in the OnStar system, if you um, have lost your keys inside your car, and uh, there's a 1-800 number you can call, you give them your credentials, and um, they can send a signal to your car to get it opened. That's another cool feature about the OnStar system. Right now I'm showing you the telescopic steering wheel. Power telescopic, of course. Okay. Go ahead and put the windows down. The windows are, uh, the front windows at least, are automatic, meaning it's one touch. 
the windows go down on its own, you don't have to hold them. Same thing for the right front. Let's see about the left rear. Now, the rear ones you gotta hold down. Okay? I'm putting the windows down so we can get a little more clarity inside so you can see better. We get memory for up to two drivers and the easy in and out. What it does is when you put the car in park and you take the key out of the ignition, the seat slides back a little bit to give you more room to get out. Get power folding mirrors, I'll demonstrate that now. Okay, now I'm going to show you when I fold out the passenger one so you can see they both work. The mirrors are also heated. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and turn off the car now. Alright. Got uh, automatic headlights. Got your fog light switch right there in the middle. Okay, back here. Well, there's your door vent sticker. Because you want to match it up with the vent of the advertised vehicle. Trying to get it to focus. There you go. You can breathe there real good. There's your tire pressure settings, which we got to readjust the left rear tires. You can see it's a little low. Uh, okay, this is your uh, child lock protection. How this works is you stick your key in here and then you twist this to one side, and what that does is that disables this inside door handle. That's in case you got children and you don't want them to um, be able to open the door without you. Okay, back here, throw the keys there. We got stereo controls and AC controls for the dual AC. It does have dual AC. There's two sets of vents in the middle here for the middle row passengers, and there's another set of vents back here for the rear row passengers. We got a uh, audio, uh, sorry, audio no vi uh, video input right down here. Those are those three color ones for like an Xbox or any type of game that that can play on the um, on the uh, video screen up there. Uh, this is for power, so you can let's say you got a Nintendo or an Xbox, you can power right from here, okay? And then you just plug in here, and voila, you get kids playing Nintendo in the car while you're driving four or five hours, and that way they don't drive you crazy. You got a couple of. Uh, jacks here for headphones okay the seats in the back are solid on this on the skirts and these sides here and perforated here in the middle very nice all right uh, let's go ahead and open the back grab the keys let me also show you the remote starting pretty cool feature that this car has the windows are down but that doesn't need this is not important for this demonstration lock in the car then you press this button here once and then hold it for the second time one two and then the light should flash and the car starts right up that's a remote starting option that's a pretty cool feature when it's hot you want to cool down the car you know as you heard now the AC compressor just went on so the car will cool down itself and in the winter the reverse you want to warm it up that way um, you know when you get to the car you know you're not freezing I believe we got um, HID lights let's see about that here let's go ahead and uh, turn the lights Yes, indeed. We got the, uh, these are the, the, I'm sure you can see the camera there. These are the high intensity lights, the ones that light up much better than your regular halogens. Go ahead and turn that off here. Put it back to automatic. Again, if you want to turn it off, all you got to do is press up here or just uh, stick the key in the ignition, open the switch, and turn it off. I'm going to press here, and you'll see the car's going to turn off. Oop, it's off now. All right, um, go ahead and unlock it for a minute so I can show you the tailgate. There you go, power tailgate. You can operate that from the front with a remote, and you can also have a third option of closing it, right pressing the switch here, which we'll do in a minute. Back here we got more power outlets for your chargers, and this is a third set of airbags right there in the back. Okay. Um, back here we got a little storage. Okay, front license plate holder in case you need that in your state. These seats, of course, they flop down. You lift this lever up here, flip it down, and then to pull it back, you just pull on the strap here. Okay? Same thing on both sides. All right, to close the tailgate, we can either push this switch over here, or we can just press the, uh, the remote. And it, flights a uh, it flashes the lights to let you know that the tailgate is closing. Okay? Come back here, we'll take a peek from this angle, and we'll conclude the video. Again, my name is George. You can be reached at 305-218-5462. The website again is vehiclemax.net.
We are open, uh, I don't know if I said this before, but if I did, I'm sorry, I'm going to repeat myself. We're open Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., Saturday 9 to 5, and we are closed on Sundays. We've been in business since 1992, and we've sold over 30,000 cars. We have an A-plus rating with a Better Business Bureau. Okay, got also power seats on the passenger side, power seat, power recliner, and lumbar support. And I'm going to see here real quick. Might have even done that already, but if I did, I apologize. And again, my name is George, and I want to thank you for watching our video.